Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Faith from Mini Mimi Thrifter. Um, today's video is going to be about what sold from Friday the 19th through Sunday the 21st. And it is Sunday at about 7 p.m. So hopefully I'll get some more sales before this video goes out. So uh, let's get right to it. Alrighty, I'm gonna warn you now, I am sick. I'm not high, unfortunately. <laughs> I just have a cold and it's driving me crazy. So I look bad and I feel bad. So anyhow, first item here is a Hot Wheels treasure hunt. It's a 2012 Ford Fiesta. It was the off-road, I see. I don't know if we're gonna be able to see the symbol. You can kind of see a little bit of it right there. And I don't wanna put on my eyes. See if I can find the symbol on the car itself. Um, yeah, it's right, it's black and white. It's right there. Oh, that focus, you piece of crap. Right there, and it's actually on the card as well. Make sure I'm pointing to the right area. Right there, the little circle with the flame inside of it. Okay, so this is part of my husband's collection, so I have zero into this item. It sold for $3.29 and the buyer's all in at $9.09. I actually only have one out, one of these left. For some reason, these four Fiestas I've started picking up. Alrighty, the next item is this little bitty vintage pin cushion. Look at the little birdie. Um, and you can see that this, the bottom here, it's, it's some kind of creature. I don't know, it's got little bumps and they, some of the bumps have green on them. You can see this looks like little feet. I saw some listings saying turtle and uh, there was something else and I was like, this don't look like a turtle. Maybe it is, but I mean, did he, whatever. Anywho, <laughs> this little booger, tiny little thing. Um, it sold for $19.54 and the buyer's all in at $26.00. 46. Let me wrap him back up. I do not need him to get broken. I cannot remember where I got this little booger. I don't think it was part of the 220 deal. I really don't remember. That's terrible. Okay. Look, look, looking good here with the purple under my eyes. Hey, I did bathe at least this morning. And the next item is actually one of the plug and play games. This is the um, Namco um, five in one plug and play. It had um, Dig Dug, uh, Pac Man, um, Galaxian. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Um, hold on, let me look real quick and see what else it had. Rally X and Bostonian. So this is part of that. Um, excuse me, I'm about to sneeze. Part of that. Shop Goodwill um, deal that I had. I think I paid $35. Oh, I just sneeze. <laughs> I've, I paid $35 for the whole thing. That was shipping included. And this is the first item to sell from that box. Um, it sold for $13.59 and the buyer's all in at $25.35. Give me just a sec. All right, the next item is this collector plate frame. It's actually called, um, the maker is Van Huygen and Smythe, Smith, S-M-Y-T-H-E. So it's a collector plate frame. It actually had a plate in it, but it was Avon. So I took the plate out and I'm gonna sell it separately. So this sold by itself at $18.69 and the buyer's all in at $27.54. This is part of the $220 deal. All right, this item actually sold back on the 14th, but the buyer didn't pay until um, Friday the 19th, and I'm not going to pull them all out. I've already got them all kind of wrapped up in bubbles. It was a lot of seven. I will pop a picture up here for you, though. A lot of seven owl figurines. There was, um, let's see. I should not remember. Like, there was a cup. There was, um, one that, I don't know exactly what it was. It was two pieces. Like, the bottom half was the torso and the top half just kind of set on top and it was the head. I don't know, just different little planters and things like that. And they were all owls. I called it an instant collection. So that sold for $10 even and the buyer's all in at 20 
All right, the next item are actually two sealed Gold Bond baby powder. And um, these were, what, about four ounces? Yeah, four ounces each. Two of them sold for $39.94, and the buyer's all in at $43.77. This was with free shipping because that's how everyone else was selling them. Um, I got these through Retail Arbitrage. Um, I didn't get as good a deal as I know someone, some others got because mine weren't on sale. But um, I think I paid like $3 a piece or $6 a piece. I can't remember exactly, but it was still a profit. So that's good. And let's see. Then there's this little glass. It's got the gold on the rim and it had the gold on the edge for the lid as well. It was no marks or anything, but it also didn't have any chips or cracks. So I just said, called it a footed candy dish. It sold for $8.49 and the buyer's all in at $24.04. Then I have a set of 21 of Jacques Cousteau's um, The Ocean World books. So gobs of these books. Good grief. Um, that's actually part of the 220 deal. Um, there's uh, some other like encyclopedias that were thrown in the 220 deal. Um, so I couldn't tell you right now how much I got into it, but as far as because of the 220 deal already in profit, I actually have zero into it. So the set sold for $48 even and the buyer's all in at $73.37. Hopefully I got the shipping right on that. Then I have a set. I made a little lot. These are sealed DVD R's. That's a 10 pack. This is a 20 pack also sealed. Now these aren't sealed, but they are brand new. Um, seven of these um, sold for, trying to get rid of them, $4.92. So uh, buyers all in at $16.76. Uh, just look at my eyes. Oh my goodness, I look just drugged up. So sorry. Um, give me a sec. All right, I forgot to add that the um, the DVD set, I have zero into them. They were just um, actually uh, my mom's and mine, so I just kind of lotted them all up. So I have zero into that item. So the next item is actually this Avon little glass vase, or I saw others listed as tumbler, so I even added that to my listing. Um, it sold for six thirty five, dollars and the buyer's all in at fifteen seventy five. dollars This is part of the two twenty dollars deal as well, so I have zero into this item. And then the next are two, also Avon. They are two little, two little bitty Owl perfume bottles. Both are empty. Both look exactly the same. The other one's still in the back here. Part of the 220 deal as well. Um, these sold for $9.95 and the buyer's all in at $16.59. And then the next item is actually, and it still has this box. It's Precious Moments, 2007 Precious Moments. It only takes a moment to show you care figurine. And it's very cute. A little baby bird in there. Maybe it's not a baby. I don't know. Anyhow, it's very cute. Good condition. It didn't sell for much. I probably didn't even make a profit on this one. It sold for $5.15. Uh, the buyer's all in at $17.23. Well, I maybe made a dollar or two. I don't know. This I had for a long time. I think I got it when I first kind of started reselling. And I didn't know what I was doing. So... <laughs> So probably maybe a dollar or two. I'll probably pay two, two, three dollars for that item. All right. The next item is a set of four collector plates. And the, this is in a series called Flowers from Grandma's Garden. I'm about to sneeze again. They're in very good condition. Um, let's see if I can find it on here. Let's see right there, W.S. George. So 
this lot of four was part of the 220 deal. So um, zero into that item. They sold for 1550 and the buyer's all in at 2968. All right, and the last item for today, or for now, is a Nintendo 3DS, 2DS carrying case. I think I gave maybe 50 cents for this little booger. And it actually has this little game in it. But at the time I listed it, this is worth nothing. So I just popped it in. Come on now. Okay, how do y'all get that crap to focus? Focus. So anyhow, it's a planes. The the Disney planes. Uh game so i don't know if the market has changed and it, i should have sold it by itself but at the time i just put it all together so it's got a case and it holds several items um so it sold for 950 and the buyers all in at 1710 so i apologize for my congestion congested look <laughs> um so if nothing else sells, then this will be the end of the video. Alrighty, everyone. Um, that is all for me today. Uh, so if you like this content, please consider giving me a thumbs up and consider subscribing as well. That's what this YouTube channel is for. Um, I try and show you the things that I'm sourcing and the things that do sell for me. So as you as a reseller can also go out and find these items or items similar. And always comp those items <coughs> if it's an item you've never sold before don't just go oh i saw that on you know harry tornado's channel comp it because he may have gotten it free and so it, you know anything is going to be a profit for him but if you if you get it if you're paying too much for the item then it's not going to be a good profit for you always comp those items all right everyone so y'all go out and make yourself proud and have a great day Bye bye